Delivering humanitarian aid to Gaza is filled with obstacles, from intricate logistics to opaque security measures. Despite the challenges Anera navigates, we are able to deliver aid into Gaza by bringing supplies through Jordan and Egypt via planes and trucks. It's virtually impossible to ship goods through Israel proper, the way Anera and other international aid groups have done business in the past. Now shipments have to pass through Egypt or Jordan to get to Gaza, sometimes on long journeys. Each country has their own bureaucratic requirements and security controls. Once aid reaches the Israel border, the Karam Shalom and Nitzana inspection points act as gatekeepers, their operations contingent upon Israeli allowances. Items labeled dual use or usable for both civilian and military purposes are rejected, delaying trucks and prolonging the wait for essential aid. Some days see more than a hundred trucks entering Gaza, while in others only a handful or none at all make it through. UNRWA distributes fuel, very scarce in Gaza, to trucks inside, ready to transport cleared aid. Palestinian truck drivers bravely complete the final leg of aid distribution. Movement restrictions and attacks on humanitarian operations severely limit access within Gaza. Despite security risks, Anera works with local partners and communities to ensure safe and direct aid delivery. Once aid clears all these hurdles, it finally reaches families in Gaza. <laughs>